the Raspberry Pi sense head will be work. So uh, this is my Raspberry Pi. Uh, so I already connected uh, with my network and uh, today I have the sense head. This is a sense head. So today what we, I will do, I will connect with the Raspberry Pi with the sense head and uh, let's see what we can do more with the sense head. So first of all, I'm connecting with the sense head. You can, you can see here, if this is showing the, some rainbow color in this. Okay, now uh, my work is uh, first of all, they will be take time, so then color will be changed. Okay, so if you see uh, the uh, now it's off, light is, is off, but you can see a Raspberry Pi is still on. Okay, so now I'm going back uh, in my first, I'm showing the demo how it will be work, and uh, I'm going in the my Raspberry Pi session. So this is my Raspberry Pi. Uh, I already logged in with the real uh, VNC. I connected with the real VNC. Now I'm going here in the programming. In the programming, you can see here, we have the Sunset em emulator. So you need to click here. And you can see here, this is showing the emulator the same like uh, I have here. Okay. Now, uh, let's suppose you, you can control this temperature, pressure, humidity with these controls. Okay, we have a control, but also we have some samples file. I will show you some sample, then we will go more how we need to write the Python code and how we can control with the Python code. So first is the humidity. So if you click on file, then open example, then sample, then humidity.py. Okay so uh, the python file will be open now you can see here showing that from sense e emu the, that is emulator and import the sense set and this is the code for the humidity so first i'm running this so you can see here the nothing is done on the emulator but uh, on this uh, device but if you can see in the emulator so uh, is showing the let me is showing some color like this one okay so we have some color is changed because it's first is a uh, white now now is it changed okay now let's make this stop and uh, i will run on my system on my device so simply i need to write the code here sense head okay that not the emulator i'm not running i don't want to run on the emulator now i want on the run on the my uh, system Okay, so I run this. Now you can see here it's showing some color here, and this is a humidity color, and it's showing the blinking here. Okay, now let's stop this one, and I'm going to the next one. So uh, we have many codes here for sample, and you can write your code also here. So uh, the second code, I'm writing one more sample here for temperature. So we need to check the temperature. For temperature, uh, we have this code. Okay, I'm simply running on the uh, my device. So I'm writing here this and set. Then I run simply. Now you can see here is showing the some blue and the red color for the temperature, and it's showing the red with the temperature. So what is the temperature right now? okay so it's showing that one now we have many uh, samples code here so you can run the sample code you can understand how this code will be work okay so for bar graph also we have so let's suppose i want to show the bar graph in my uh, inverter so how i can run it so i will run here sense head then i will simple run this so now you can see here is showing some bar graph here. Okay, we have red graph, green and the uh, blue graph. Same like we have a line graph and many graphs are there. So you can run any graph and uh, you can show also the name here. Alphabets also you can show with this display. So in the advanced, you can see here the joystick is, uh, in sense menu. Many graph are here, line graph, rainbow. Okay, let's suppose I'm showing the the sensor menu so this is sensor menu and uh, let me change here since it and then i will run now you can see here some alphabet is here okay it's showing like h o here and here we have a t and p 
okay so also you can write some alphabet here and you can show uh, the this with the display so in the next session we will, i will show you how this simulator we can write a code how we can write from the scratch uh, in the more advanced thank you guys